evening. I go by the name of Solo. Welcome back to Solo Driven. Now today we're going to be going over to my friend Alex's house because he got a new toy that we're going to be introducing to y'all today and we're going to be putting them head to head. So I already got the car started and warmed up. Let's not waste any more time. Let's head over there and see what he got. And what a beautiful day to take a cruise. Nice clear skies. And let's just say we have booze weather. <laughs> All right, guys, we made it to Alex's house. Now, last time y'all seen this car, we put it head to head with the Hades Cobra and it completely demolished it. I'll leave a link in the description below to that video, but let's just say there has been some changes to the car. Now, last time you saw it, it had the Kenny Bell 2.2 and now it's been upgraded to the VMP Gen 3R, which is pushing probably more close to the what? Uh, definitely over 700 and probably like mid 700s with this pulley setup. <laughs> yeah, this thing is a completely different animal. So, you know what? We're going to go take this thing out for a ride. Uh, he's going to take me out for a ride right now because I haven't been in this car uh, since the upgrade. And yeah, I might shit my pants. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty nervous right now. <laughs> I'm already nervous and I haven't even, he hasn't even punched it. Oh damn, is that a cop? Oh, oh, we were getting ready to send it and look what popped up. <laughs> Never mind. First gear terror, here we go. That was a crazy ride. The Gen 3 R. Any guesses, any guesses? All right guys, so this lucky guy bought another Termi. But yeah, what's better than one Cobra, two Cobra. Basically, my friend Brian, he had uh, this car before I did, and he found it in Northwest Texas, and he had it for a while, and eventually he was gonna get rid of it because he was gonna get another car. 
So mm. I ended up asking him how much he wanted for it and we ended up coming to agreement. So I bought the car from him just to kind of keep it in the friendship. I was gonna get a better daily driver, but instead I decided to just get this one instead and stay with Oh yes, way better, way better, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna enjoy it as a cruiser for now. Yeah, just... yeah, yeah, definitely. Especially since you have that beast over there, you can kind of chill out with this one. Obviously this one has an aftermarket upper pulley. Not really sure what it is, maybe a 2.8, 2.73, not sure. But we're gonna put it head to head with the stock pulley that the uh, that my car has versus an aftermarket pulley and see the difference on the two and which one will win. They're gonna be in the same horsepower bracket because they have just about the same mods intake. I have a couple cooling mods, uh, the radiator, the heat exchanger. This one has a heat exchanger as well. The only difference is that this one has pulleys, that one doesn't. With all that being said, let's go. Put these two head to head. neck to neck what do you think yeah i think it was a pretty good run neck to neck the first one you got me real good i was like okay this didn't happen last time we raced and then the second one i was able to to keep up but yeah let us know in the comment section below which one you think took the w out of these two so a familiar face we got my boy Yo. chris gfx what's up guys back here uh we're gonna be doing some stuff for you guys give him a follow because he's been putting out a lot of content on instagram TikTok, youtube so give him a follow i'll leave the link down in the description below give him a follow Quite a busy day today, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Now, before we end today's video, I wanna take a quick second to talk about these hoodies. Now, for those that know, I created this logo, and really, I just started making shirts and a hoodie to have some to rock on camera and to kinda of like represent the whole solo-driven movement, and I had no real intentions of selling this stuff, at least not anytime soon, but I've actually been getting quite a lot of requests for shirts and hoodies, and I'm, so grateful for you guys support and for the most part I was sending them out for free but unfortunately I can't continue to do that because you know we have a project car to build so what I decided to do was I started an Instagram page solely for merch and that is at solo driven 
at solodriven.inc. I'll leave a link also in the description below. The hoodie is like in a navy blue with a white logo and it also has a print in the back. So if anyone is interested in merch, solodriven.inc. Now what I've also decided to do was take a portion of the proceeds and donate it to the MDA, which is the Muscular Dystrophy Association. Now for those that have been following for a while, y'all probably know why I would donate to this specific association and that is because my godson was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. So what I decided to do was some of the proceeds of the profit, I'm gonna donate a percentage of that to the MDA. So not only are you helping support the channel, but you are donating to a good cause. But anyways guys, that's gonna end today's video. If you liked it, make sure to subscribe, smash that like button, and remember, be motivated, stay driven. <laughs>